Hi guys, hope all is well with everyone today. So as Tata says, I am bringing you the Sonic Casher um, brush set review. And this is what it looks like. And it is a great, I just put it back in the box. I've been using it, but so you can know what it, how this, how it, it would, this is how it comes in the packaging. And it's great. It has a great floral background. So let's just jump right in. So you just take this off like that. And the hole right here. And I'm just going to take them out one by one. One thing I do like about this brush that if you take out this inside piece that they have here, I think you have, just take that out, I think you have like a great box. It's so pretty. This is the base and the sides are nice. Like all around is just a nice um, floral box. So I have a Sonic Kasha that didn't come with it, but a uh, Sonic Kasha um, brush holder. And this is just be just great for your vanity. Like, isn't that cute? Like, just so nice and springy or nice, whatever. Anyway, let's jump into the review because I'll just go on and on and on and on. So, this is the brush, the brush set, and this is the the tapered um, brush, the buffer brush, um, the dome brush, and the foundation brush. I will say, out of all these four brushes, um, this one I, I use um, the least. Um, I don't use it for foundation. I have used it for my concealer. They're all soft, they're all nice, but um, I've used it for my concealer to kind of like to apply, to apply my concealer underneath my eye. And I've also did it like to contour my under my to contour my nose and so forth. But it is soft, so there's nothing bad I can say about the brush. They're so cute. They have I don't know if you can see that. I'm gonna zoom so you can see that. Like it has a SK. I hope I can see. Okay, here we go. That SK right there. And all of them in all the colors, purple, pink, and orange. They're all right there. Now, <clears throat> by going in order, or just not really going in order, but just picking, you come to this brush. This brush is such a great brush for your blush. Um, I haven't put any highlight on with this brush, but I feel like it just picks up the product. I don't know if it's because it's so tapered or it's so soft. They all hella soft, but it picks up um, the product very well, and you can just place it like. Be careful wherever you place this brush, that's where it's gonna leave it. It's just like it's like you just place it right here, and it just goes like whoop, and yeah, it's really nice. So be careful with this brush. Don't be too heavy-handed with this brush, but it is a great brush, and they are so soft. I'm sorry, I'm repeating myself, but they're so so soft. Now, this brush is um. The buffer brush as they call it I believe yeah I use this to set my my foundation with my setting powder my black opal and I just it picks up the product very nice and I just go over my face with it you know little shiny spots like right in here and I just go over and it is just it's just, just it's a soft I mean I don't know it's like it's just so soft and nice and I love the color it's so cute if you can see that they all have nice colors oh if I did mention it they're from Target um, I got it from Target.com. I believe they were like twenty or twenty-one dollars.com, twenty to twenty-one ninety-nine. So check it out and see if your Target have your local Target have it, or definitely check um online and see if they have it. <sighs> last but not least, I have to save this last brush because I know it's gonna be. I'm looking at the time and I'm like, it's gonna be a long one on this brush. This brush, mm, where do I start? Mm. You know, I ran some of these brushes. This brush surprised me. I don't know how or when I decide to just decide to when I decide to use it for my concealer. I love this brush for my concealer. I have been using this brush and I do not use my beauty blender to um to blend out under my, my eyes. This bl brush, this dome brush has done miracles. It is so dense like it's like the dense, a dense brush, but when you wet it with like a fix plus or anything, and you spray it, it will come so soft. So I'm gonna show a quick demo on it. So I'm just gonna reach for. Sorry guys, I'm not trying to be dramatic. I just wanted you to see what you're getting. My um, NYX um, concealer, and I don't have a mirror, so please do not get. Um, so using a little finder here. Okay, and I sprayed it. Ready? All right, let's go. I'm going to show you. Like, 
I want you to see. I have a mirror up here, so that's why I'm looking here. Like how this blends out your concealer. I mean, just by just wetting it, it's like amazing. It is crazy. And that's it. And of course, I did not set it with my, any powder yet, but yeah. Let's get an idea. That's how it sets it. Just like that. Blends it to the skin. This brush right here. This dome brush. Okay. Like, yeah. This is it. It is amazing for concealer. I. This is like my favorite. And then it's like these two would be like my second favorite. And this would be like my third favorite. Because I love both of these brushes. But this is like my number one favorite. If you could find. I don't know if they sell this by itself. But if you could find a dome brush like this by itself. By the Sony Cash. I would definitely say. You should get this brush before any of these. But the set is really pretty. Like, I think the set is pretty. It's not that expensive. It's budget friendly. They're beautiful colors for the um, spring and summer. So I definitely recommend it. I was been, I have been sleeping on Sonic Kasha. I'm so sorry. These brush are amazing. So that's all I have for today. Um... Like and subscribe, and I cannot wait to see my next video. And guys, comment below. I want to see what's going on for the spring and summer. Tell me if there's any brushes that you're trying or anything new. I am definitely, you know, I always want to hear from you guys. So thanks for watching, and, and see you soon. Bye, guys.